Yeah, my mic, my single mic can just mute just Dayton. It just knows the tone of your voice. Like, <laughs> oh, there's a the fucking explodes. Dayton guy again. All right, hi everybody. Can you move your foot a little? Like you get to play first, and you're gonna do this. So we have a. This is our one year anniversary of Panic Mania. So we thought we'd have a special, a special uh, Panic Cast with our least on the show guest Dayton, because we've actually had Dil- D- Dave on more. Uh. Sure. He was on two or three episodes for Final Fantasy XIV. Dane's only been on one, unless you count the phone. Where, what level are you starting on? This one. No, start at the beginning, you dimble. Why? Because we're playing... Why? So the the viewer... God damn it. Sorry, everybody. Dane broke the... How do I do this again? It's fucking... Just go back in time. Reset game. There we go. All right. Start from the beginning. Start a new file. I'm just, I'm anyway, just... so to make it special, instead of casual Animal Crossing running in the background, we will still instead have us playing Mario World at the same time. This is Let's dinosaur land. Okay, Dan, <laughs> don't press the button. How do I? It just goes. It's an old game. Kids were stupid when they read. They kid that t- that would have took a kid three years. Dylan couldn't read that now. Welcome. This is dinosaur land. This dinosaur Anyways, land. so how has one year been, Dylan? One year. Yeah. Yeah. It passed. It passed. It went by. We're back into Spook Fest soon. Uh, it's been pretty good for me. Yeah. What'd you do? Wait, what, what's been going on for you? It's been a shit year. Well, okay. Yeah, on a scale of one to ten. How shit? Uh, pretty shit. I'm poor all the time. All right, so every yeah, time nothing new. So this is the one rule we're gonna we're gonna say: you beat a level, you switch it; you die, you switch it. I never die. All right, well then you'll switch when you beat the level. Then. <laughs> Anyways, so me and Dylan are gonna do our best to not acknowledge the gameplay, and only Dayton can say shit. Pardon me. We've How been drinking. Your year? I mine's been pretty good, honestly. Yeah, on a scale of one to ten. I'd, I'd give it about a a seven. Alright. Because I can res- drive. That's respectable. Yeah, you're an adult now. Uh, I've got... Only got hair on your balls? You can do the spin with the R. Or <laughs> X button. Yeah, there you go. Oh, I just want to teach shit, that. dude. Uh, yeah, lots of good games have come out this year. Yeah, like what? Final Fantasy. 14 came out this year. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to 2013, fellas. <laughs> Dane is just good in his first puby hair. Yay! 2013, I was. I had two. 15. I had two puby hairs at that point, Jesse. I would, I okay, a, if you want to be a full head about it, hair. it started in 2010. Oh, yeah, but we're not. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not acknowledging the gameplay. <laughs> that doesn't kill it. It's a bullet. Oh, you gotta kill the bullet with the shell? But, uh, yeah, I, I thought it was a pretty good year. I got a moped. Me and my dad spent a lot of time fixing it, but it's fixed now. It was broken for a while there. Uh, was anything crazy happened in the last few weeks to you, Dylan? It's gonna be confusing. I'm gonna be saying Dylan. I got a new computer. He started streaming. Yeah, Dylan's got yeah. Captain Dilbin at twitch.tv.twitch. Twitch, 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 twitch. Twitch.tv slash Captain Dilbin. Oh, shit. Dilbin twitch tv dot kick the shell. Good one. Yeah, whatever. I do. You're not supposed to acknowledge me. I decided to go to school and this COVID shit's over. Bullshit. For what? Yeah, yeah. I don't know if it'll actually happen, but I want to. What do you want to do? No clue yet. Okay, well then, you don't make any plans. You just oh, said I wanted to. You know what I made hear plans. Funny. You said, I said I wanted to. You should be a paramedic. It's like saying I, I want to be cool. rich. I don't have plans to be rich. <laughs> you should I do. You're like a fucked idiot. Oh. I should be a paramedic? Yeah. Why? Because I said that a, f- a month ago. Oh, yeah, and then you're a copycat, you fucking loser. <clears throat> I... I want to go to school for video editing because I know how I to... I thought you wanted to be a cop. I want to be a cop like 12 years ago. Get over it. No, you said that like a year ago. Okay, I'm not doing it's this been a year, Dylan. You guys can do that level, honestly. I don't want to. It's too hard. All right. I'll do it, coward. All right, good. Oh, yeah, I'm not allowed to talk for about it. For what, what, what are you going to school for? Uh, video editing and stuff. Well, video editing is a minor skill. Okay. Uh, I still want to get yeah, better at still it. I still got a good job for yeah. it. Yeah. There's no, like specific video editing yes there is program no there's not a video editing program but there's, there's school classes. yeah the, the video editing isn't just for youtube there's like video no edi- I, th- that's what i'm trying to say yes what, what do you want to take because video editing is a broad thing well it's one thing there is a course that's for everything it's kind of right what do you what do you want to take it's kind of horseshit you mean? that you have to take... It's, it's literally a like whole you class. You can't just take what you want what? in college. No. Yes, it is. You can't just take one class. Well, yeah, I don't know. I'll figure the other shit out later. There's also digital media and production. Or digital media and whatever. Something. DMP. 
Uh, and that is what Brandon took and Kent. Uh, but that's... I thought Kent took uh, journalism. Yeah, that's the course. So the first year is just general, like, media shit. And then you branch off into two different things. One is, like, news anchor shit. And uh, the other is... So it's, it's like skill trees. Something else, yeah, essentially. I still want to be... Like, I still have the dream of becoming a video game, like, coder and shit. But apparently the there's no good courses in Lethbridge. Yeah. Also, if you have you to want. go to, like, Edmonton or... Well, and even if you have the, 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 I thought yeah, you were gonna do. Hey, say. Mister, I thought you were gonna do the one level. Mm. It's like a big shot. I forgot, but yeah, apparently you have to go to like Edmonton or Vancouver, and I. Well, I'm really scared to move. I'm also, yeah, me too. also, if you want a job, Lethbridge is actually shit. Yeah, well, yeah oh, absolutely. I would move once I had the fucking education. Um. Well, you can go move to like Montreal or something. They have a good <laughs> education for it. Wow, <laughs> Frank. Like Montreal has good education courses for it, and they have jobs. Yeah, like you Montreal. and your fucking Montreal. Montreal's That's good. So far nobody away. wants to it go is. to Montreal. I'll go to Montreal if you, if you pay the way. Yeah, just you can meet I your pay fucking the way dildos. with what money? I don't know. Pay the way <laughs> with his fucking well, temp no. cook job. If I was gonna move somewhere, no, I want to move with. I said he's paying me. I'm not. I, he. I, I said he pays the way. I can't oh. meet new people. I said I'll go. Yeah, You're but, not my friend. <laughs> I can't pay for you. Oh, I'm a god. <laughs> um, I would... Uh, Montreal, you can get a lot of jobs in game testing, which is why I would want to move to Montreal. Plus, yeah. they have to Oh, I guess if sucks. I was moving to Montreal for a job, I would move. But I would not move for the education. QA testers are treated like shit. If any, yeah, if so I was going to move anywhere... I'm treated like shit I already every... get treated like yeah. shit. <laughs> <laughs> if I was going to move anywhere for the education, I would want to move to Vancouver. But it's so fucking expensive yeah yeah Montreal's not that expensive that's for the my, job my f- well friend your friend's uh, an idiot she went to vancouver for like makeup like what what's it called when you do makeup and hair and shit uh style i also have a friend that did makeup uh, in vancouver aesthetician or, no know. you're stupid that's a final fantasy thing um yeah so she went there and she works in her house in lethbridge and works at choppers now I know uh, a makeup girl that took the makeup course and she does real work as a makeup artist. Where? Uh, in Vancouver. Oh, sure. Uh, but I also heard... I, I can't say too many specifics because right. uh, um, she doesn't like no, being uh, friends with me. Yeah, well, I used to work with a guy... <laughs> I was going to say, I who, also uh, don't like being friends with you. <laughs> worked on Frozen and he worked on uh, The Flash and fucking Once Upon a Time... And he worked for a catering business on the side because he was like, oh, I'm too fucking cool. I need to do this <laughs> shitty job sometimes. And I was um, like, Scott, you're so fucking cool. Oh, now you said so, his name. Now we'll know. Yeah. We'll, just look up the, we'll look up the whole thing. There's only there's got to only be one guy in all Frozen named Scott. Corey's do ex- your, do your one boyfriend. Thing. Do your uh, one thing. Robin, who still hangs oh, out with the whole group. Do the um, switch. Calgary friends. It's too hard. He, uh... He, he, he took the ca- the course in Vancouver for game editing and shit. And he no! Told, stop! Sorry. He told me that if I was going to go to Vancouver and take a game editing course, or any game editing course, that I needed to network hard. Yeah. Because even if you get the course... Life in general is networking hard. Yeah. If you want to get anywhere in anything... Get the like, mushrooms. God damn. Where's the mushrooms? I mean, the corn. And that's the hardest shit get off ever. Yoshi? Because he's slow. Cause like I just hold the run button. Well, oh, now we lost our Yoshi, and you didn't get any coins. I didn't like I don't know how to network. Okay, I barely know how to talk yeah, to strangers That's, in general. That that conversation really made me not want to do video game thing, just because I don't talk to new people. Well, that's yeah. the whole thing about any successful course, honestly. I pushed them. I was lying. It wasn't a hard course; just easy to beat. Well, so the I didn't do the, it. Uh, what the, the business. Hell? Give me another one. Uh, program at the university. Oh. All right. Uh, the ma- they have like an entire class based on networking, and uh, when I used At to the work university, for you said? yeah, in the business course, mm-hmm. you should become a film director. And they would literally Me? have like parties and shit where business right. students would go and fucking network with other business students. I would never network because I heard networking kills more than saves. Well, no swim. I don't remember how. Why? No, I think it's just jump on. I don't know, networking to me seems like what my stepdad does. 
Well, they get your stepdad to work for you. I don't know. Naturally. Like, yeah, where people can just meet people. Yeah, he's just and friends like, with everyone. You want to go for beers sometimes? And it's like, no, I don't know you. It takes me a good but three months to build people, that up. Yeah, I do that all I, the time. I'm actually, like, I, as an anxious person as I am, I always try to, like, actually be more friendly. So if anybody invites me to ever do anything, I almost always try to say yes, unless I, like, oh, don't God have the time, it. obviously. Yeah, I, I'll always say yes to... Well, then new people you're, asking me to. Then that's part of you. You don't have the same roadblock Dylan has, because oh. Dylan's roadblock is he would say no. Yeah, absolutely. true. But my problem is, I find that if I don't invite people to things, I'll never get invited. Get that fire flower. The, the last person that, I panicked. All right. The last person that like went out Dead. of their way to hang out with me as a new person was Mike. Yeah. And through Mike, what I started hanging out with you. I think. No, I hung up. Well, it was I either mean, you or... No, it was Dallas that I started hanging out with you because of. Because you came over to play Splatoon once. Splatoon? Splatoon. Oh, well, yeah, we played right. Bomberman at Dallas's. We played Splatoon online. Yeah, you're right. And you said, this game's okay. So, so like, you just splat? I'm so bad at breaking that let's do something outside of work yeah, hurdle. Yeah, absolutely. That it doesn't happen for 90% of the people I meet. Well, like, I'm so bad with uh, conversation in general that even if I did... I can't talk to new people, like, at all. Like, even Cat. Like, I work with Cat. I didn't say a goddamn thing to Cat the yeah, whole time. Yeah, but to be fair, Cat didn't say a goddamn thing True. The it is easier with other people who God, are really bad at that. better at conversation. But if I was better, that wouldn't be a problem in general. Well, uh, Cat's weird. She doesn't talk to me very much, and I, I think we get along pretty well. Fair. So, like, networking, where you have to get through that hurdle and also advertise yourself. Mm-hmm just seems impossible to me oh just fucking run dude well i was i didn't know i'd kill the shell i also don't have the music to <laughs> go off of if this is gonna run out so. <laughs> well, it's not gonna wind all of that's the plan that lasts a long time it does last a long time i just didn't know when it wasn't gonna last anymore if yeah. that makes sense what's your dream job dylan I could not even tell you. Oh, yeah. my dream job is a YouTuber slash Twitcher. 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 I do feel like I have a social... I'm pretty good at social stuff for considering how anxious I am, though. Like, I I haven't been as good lately just because it's so hard to advertise a YouTube or Twitch channel without getting blocked by sites. Yeah. So I stopped doing it. But there used to be a new tubers thing that you could go and post it on your, your YouTube and stuff. But they Reddit just shadow blocks you and you don't even know. Like, huh. if... I would have no problem. That's why I don't like using Reddit. Because it's like, shadow blocking is so stupid to me. Tell me that I'm blocked. Yeah. I understand what I did wrong. Let me know why. <laughs> Just not saying anything is the dumbest shit. I used, but, to, I used to think that, like, Twitch streaming... Oh, what the fuck? You can't touch a turtle. I didn't even think I did. I used to think Twitch streaming and YouTube vi video making would be my dream job. Uh, but now that I've tried it, I, I still think it would be. But... It's a dream it would job be in, a different in way. ten years, or not ten. Like, it would be in two or three years when I have the audience and I have the pers the like the skills to be able to talk to them. Well, I'm, Cause I, right now I, I can't. Like, I don't know. I definitely think YouTube is the reason why I'm so social. Like, um, I think I'm more social because I've done YouTube and stuff so much, and I've cultured myself a lot more, so I know more stuff about everything. But. Uh, like, because when I first started, like, go look at my original YouTube channels. I don't, I'm a fucking dumbass. <laughs> but, like, I used to do, there's these, this one, these one YouTubers. I'm still friends with them. Um, um, we used to hang out. The same called board. the, yeah, if they're on the other side of the cage, they won't hurt you. Oh, is, does that flip? Yeah. Yeah. Huh. Um, but they're called Kinda Cool Dudes, and they messaged oh, yeah. me randomly on the YouTubers. And uh, we ended up hanging out and stuff a lot, too. Like, we did videos together and stuff. Yeah, it was a good time. Yeah, we played Doom with them once. You're dead. Ooh. Oh, you're, I forgot this was in Mario 3. You'd be dead if that was Mario 3. But, yeah. I'm trying to Twitch stream with who I am right now. I feel like... I felt like I couldn't enjoy the games because I was too focused <laughs> on trying to be entertaining. Well, there's so many... Like, you, you just, the entertaining will come later. Just play the game and try to at least talk to people. I think this is the best first step. Well, yeah, for me, I don't really... If I have nothing to say, I don't force myself. Except for Dark Souls. Dark Souls, I find it to be a bit more... It's because you know so much easy, about the game. Yeah. My problem is, say, when like, nobody's watching, it's hard for me to... Because, like, they say just keep talking as even if it, there's no one watching. I and think so, that's like, dumb. Yes, well, but it makes sense to do that. 
Uh, uh, I get why you do that, but the problem I have with it is I hate making little jokes. I, I definitely get reactions off people, and if I don't get those reactions, it's a lot harder. Like, even when I do Let's Plays with Dylan, if Dylan doesn't fucking say anything, I'm like... And I just kind of die out because I'm like, Dylan didn't laugh at my. Ugh! I almost died because I was doing the team back. <laughs> um, so, like, that's a big problem for me. But I've gotten better at it where I'll just make the joke and then, like, there'll still be, like, a kind of awkward silence after, which I think adds to it sometimes. <laughs> like, says a dumb joke and then Mario blows up a castle and kills a whole entire village of people. Yeah. There's definitely. A, it's, it's definitely a lot easier to be in that personality. Because I feel like. I, there's different personality states. Obviously. And uh, it's definitely a lot easier when you have someone to talk to, like, oh, yeah. in voice chat. I imagine it's a lot easier when you have a lot of people talking in your chat. I don't like a lot of people in voice chat. It gets annoying when there's yes, two. No, no, absolutely. Like, like when I streamed with three. Dallas and them playing Among Us and I couldn't get well, a word in. that's the other problem is with Dallas and, like, everyone for Among Us, there's, there's, there's like, two other people Twitch streaming. Right. And that's where the problems really and start to coincide. big, like, loud personalities. Well, not just that, but, me. like... They're, when you Twitch stream, they always gotta like, oh, you can't say that on my channel and stuff. And I, I didn't know if that happened, but like, I remember whenever I stream with Dallas, I always had to watch my mouth because he streams for little baby boys. Right. And that's that's why I just I don't even try for that. I'm like, whatever. I'm never gonna be that person, and I'm not gonna try for that person. Yeah. I'd rather have adult audiences that I don't ever get rich off of, but I have a good right. time. Well, there are plenty of people who are quite adult, and they, you know. Yeah. Oh, 100 percent successful. Well, and also. Kids don't have money. That's yeah, a bad audience. Like, eventually, true. sure. But then they're going to grow up and they're not going to like you anymore. You know who always has money? Adults. Well, I feel like kids is more of a YouTube thing. Yes, I, oh, 100%. You don't, you don't YouTube. To Except for my little brother, because apparently he knows all of the Twitch speak. Like, uh, my little brother was on my stream <laughs> the other day, and he was... He's spelling his shit, which I expect for a 10-year-old. But, don't like... He, th he the oh, yeah. phrases, well, the phrases he would use in everything. I was just like, "Who the fuck am I talking to right now?" <laughs> like he he knew like Twitch jargon and shit. Maybe your brother's smarter than you. Have you thought about that? I, I genuinely think he is. Well, I think the the average bear is honestly. You can eat those. <laughs> Jesus Christ! I can eat these. You can eat anything. He's Yoshi, except don't eat the balls. Balls? No. Oh. I tried to eat the balls. Yeah, myself. with your Mario. <laughs> uh, so what did you guys think of Big Trouble in Little China? It was funny. Yeah, it was A lot of good ridiculous. situational shit. Um, chicks were hot. Yeah. Yeah. Two main character chicks. Even the, even the ugly girls were kind of hot. I feel like it would not pass in today's market. Really? I don't think it's super offensive. Uh, you underestimate. Yeah, that. well... Yeah. People don't like... Uh, I forget how to fly. Stereotypes anymore. Also, a white man being the main character in yeah. a Chinese-looking film. That was the whole idea. That's why he's shitty in it. Yeah. Fair, but uh, some people might not get that. Wow, that's... It's the majority of people. Well, to be fair, yeah. the movie didn't do well when it came out. Yeah, <laughs> yeah true. true. It did really fucking shitty. Um, did you guys hear, hear like big criticism over the, the Great Wall or whatever that Matt Damon movie is? Oh, God, it was so bad yeah but that movie, movie was actually yeah, bad I liked it that was an actual bad movie like well, there was nothing okay it, it was visually I'm... appealing just because it's monsters and blah 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 it was about monsters yeah I had okay I've never seen the movie I just thought it was a shitty fucking Matt Damon go stop the move the wall <laughs> no no so it was like it was actually I, he's I a traitor it. it's probably shit but I enjoyed shit, it and he uh goes to China to buy gunpowder and uh they're like, buddy, you don't want to fucking be here. We got some shit going on. He's like, fuck you, I want gunpowder. And they're like, uh, some other Chinese guy was like, I can get you in, I can get you some fucking gunpowder. And then they sneak in to the Great Wall. And then it turns out that the Great Wall uh, like defends China from hordes and hordes and hordes of monsters that are kind of like the, the like monster, the alien things from Endgame. That like crash upon the the shield in Wakanda. Oh, like the oh, alien yeah, yeah, things. Yeah. <clears throat> so you're saying you're it saying was, I don't like I don't like Chinese action, but I didn't mind the movie. Other than that, uh, there was some cool bits. 
I like the part where they like go down on the ropes with yeah, the spears. That was cool. All in all, though, it was just kind of like a why did this why does this movie exist kind of thing. True. Yosh! Like I doubt it was anybody's passion project. But yeah, I, I imagine people these days would also hate Little uh, Big Trouble or what the fuck is it called? Big Trouble in Little China. Yeah, that one. Little Trouble Big Lands. <laughs> God damn it! I thought it was called Little Big and Little China. <laughs> I thought it was the Arnold Schwarzenegger movie. I think you're mixing up a bunch of movies when you say that. No, I just because because it was Little Big and Danny DeVito's Little and Arnold is huge, so I thought that's what it was about. Because I've never actually seen either movie. My Yosh. That was risky business, dude. Yeah, but Yosh is worth. Oh, now let me lose all I liked of your it. Upgrades. I like it. It's a, good, it's a good movie. It was funny. Yeah, it's, it's definitely a hilarity. I enjoyed the main character being a, a useless piece of shit. I love when he shoots <laughs> at the beginning. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and then the only time <laughs> gets the knife. <laughs> so I'm so the reflexes. reflex, baby. And then all the statues break. No, I eat. <laughs> just sit and watch. Uh, do, 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 just do. watch that whole mess happen. <laughs> yeah, that was good. <clears throat> and I liked how it was like pretty self-aware Fuck. in that it was like lost, yeah for a 1986 your, movie it's it's pretty I lost well, well I mean there's plenty Get the mush. that was a pretty common hum- oh, comedy I got, trope I got, I got like, no have you ever watched like Kung Pao Kung Pao was after still they cop Kung Pao copied Big Trouble before that only Big Trouble okay <laughs> okay <laughs> Mario just Dex Yoshi to get him to eat things. We can't comment on that. <laughs> Don't tell Peter. God Peter. damn it. <laughs> damn it. <laughs> Die. <laughs> Trying to get this Yosh. Uh-huh. These goddamn birds. I don't think Dane's beaten a level yet. <laughs> nope. No, wait, you did beat the Switch level. Oh, yeah, you're right. <laughs> the one with no enemies? Yeah. I'm practically a god. <laughs> you ate game. that bird. <laughs> Anyways. I liked it. I think it was good. Bonk, and then we played bonk, Exploding Cassidy. Dylan cheated. Well, actually, Natasha cheated, which allowed him to win. You played what? Exploding Cats. How did she cheat? Uh, because uh, Dustin told her where my cards. Oh <laughs> yeah. Well, you and Dallas. I fucking should... looking at my cards in the reflection. No, I actually didn't. I've, if I was looking in your cards in the reflection, I would not have took a nope. I would have taken a fucking dis. What are they called? Yeah, yeah. I would have took a defuse. I would have won if I took a defuse. The no did me no good. I didn't use it. Because it was I, useless. I got to play my favorite card, so I was happy. Yeah, but you died first, so it's like, who cares if you're happy? Me. Yeah. I got um 3K <laughs> crit in Final Fantasy now. Mm-hmm. Gross. How do you no. feel about that? Good. I was... You crit. <laughs> <laughs> Only you could die there. <laughs> you were testing it out. You were... I honestly you didn't. Even, you could even sacrifice Yoda. Yoda. <laughs> Yoshi. Yoda. Yeah, get Yoda out of there. <laughs> Put this baby sacrifice Yoda. Sacrifice him. <coughs> <sighs> me and Cole made sushi not too long ago. Actually, I don't think we talked about that. I'm like, did we ever talk about me and Cole made sushi? No, I don't think so. It was really good. We made a uh, spicy tuna. Oh. And we like got fresh cut of tuna. So good. Uh, I also found out if you have you ever eaten a lot of wasabi. Uh, no. Isn't it spicy? Yes, but have you ever done it? No, I've never eaten wasabi, so... Um, so I started, because Cole's like, you gotta try wasabi. So I was like, okay, and then I was like, I'll just try some of Emily's. And I was like, oh, no, I put a lot in there. I'm like, I, I love spicy food, whatever. So I put it in, the soy sauce wasabi mix, eat it. Have you, you know what brain freeze is, right? Uh, yeah. Wasabi is the only food that does this to me, that I've ever noticed. And I eat quite a few spicy things. Like, I've never eaten, like, a California Reaper or anything. Wasabi gives you heat, like brain heat. Like your whole top of your head heats up, and your nose is like feels like you breathe fire. Huh? It's super weird. I've had that before, but mainly from like excessive working, running or something. Shut up. It's not legit. My whole face feels like it's on fire. Oh, well, Jesse, beat another level, shall we? Yolo. I'm gonna actually. This is actually a pretty hard level, honestly. Yeah, pretty hard. Well, Mario Super Mario World's probably one of the hardest Mario games. What about Mario 2? Okay, Mario 2 is the hardest Mario game without <laughs> I'm not count that because it was never released what about here. about Legend of Zelda 2? Because that's not... Uh, Legend of Zelda 2 is not even the hardest. It's just annoying. What about... 
Electric Boogaloo too. <laughs> You've been warned about that, Dylan. God damn it, I thought it would bounce off his stupid fucking robot head. I delivered to the tattoo convention. Oh yeah, how was that? Shit. Did you get a tattoo? It was a five hundred dollar order that they got for free. And they didn't tip me. Well it's because tattoos it took me three trips. Tattoo artists are uh, cheap fu- Whoa, he's did you guys see that? I know I said I know I said not to comment, but he was he was going on his own trip. Did no one see that? No. We're not allowed to comment. Well, I mean, I saw it, but I didn't really know what was upsetting about it. Uh, he was fucking in the rocks and going... And teleporting up. Okay, then I did not see that. Finding his own land. <clears throat> uh, but yeah, we went to my work. Dylan had two wraps. Dane had a pulled pork on garlic toast because we were out of buns because Casey took three years to get there. It's pretty good. Well, I had one wrap. Poutine was not oh, yeah, great. Yeah, he didn't eat the other one. Yeah, really? I like the poutine. I a. Don't like cheese curds. I, oh. I like shredded cheese in my poutine. Well, then you don't like poutine. And B, yeah. I like fries and not taters. Oh, I like the taters. We do have French fries, but we feel don't like normally with have taters. The the fry or the the potato to to, to everything else ratio is off. Um, and with the with the curds, small with the too. small ones are they are I would assume. But cheese curds, um, you're supposed to break them up. But it's not a poutine without cheese curds. If you use shredded cheese, it's not a poutine. It's uh, yeah, it is. Shut no, it's the not. Fuck it's up. called something else. It's gonna kill me. Yes. I did not know that went up all the way. Only you could die there. I didn't die jumping after testing the jump uh, for it. I didn't say you did. Just said only you could die there. Because only you have. <laughs> <laughs> you would have died there. I, was, I thought I was going to. But yeah, I, I really like our poutines. Although, that being said, I've never had a regular poutine for my work. I always get one of the different flavor kinds. Mm. Kobe made me try. We went to a Canadian brew house. Uh -huh. They're not that good. For the price? No. Well, yeah, they're good. They're decent, but I'd yeah, rather go to Browns. For the, not for the price. The beer there is good. Move up. He's gonna. Yeah. Okay. Sorry. I didn't um, want you to. Die. But he made me get this brisket poutine, mm -hmm. and it was not good. <laughs> the fucking it's barbecue sauce, which does not. Oh. <laughs> you had the same. You had the opposite version of what happened. To yeah, me. I thought it would not go. I thought it would hit the ground. Yeah. Don't go really, back up. If they have like, what's the point of this? Then? Yeah. Um, to trick you. But yeah, the poutine with barbecue sauce, it's weird. Yeah, I would agree with that. Um, That's like when people put fucking ketchup in poutine. Like, go kill oh, yourself. Oh, what? They do that? Dallas does. You either have Dallas gravy does, or ketchup. Dallas does. Fucking... Gravy and ketchup are the same thing, but different flavors. You can't have both. Um, that being said, we have a Dude, butter chicken poutine. And asshole. I was very close to getting it, as you guys know. And our butter chicken poutine's really good. It's like a good mix of both butter chicken and a poutine. Cause you get like you're like mmm tasty. I think poutine's fine the way it is. People need to oh, stop yeah. fucking with shit. No, I agree. But there's, you, you gotta you can't make a poutine restaurant just sell poutine. <clears throat> right. I, yeah, I guess. But uh, I tried this poutine. And I can at understand like the piggyback. Yeah, I don't like piggyback. Yeah, I didn't mind it. I don't uh, know. No, I don't. Had, think, oh, we missed it. I, as a person who enjoys the taste wow. of food but hates eating. I think people just get too bored with food because they like oh, eating too much. I True. I agree with that. Well, no, but the point of it is it's a restaurant. I think it's more... I get what you're saying. I though. get that. And also, Lethbridge is not the kind of place to have a small menu. As much as I disagree, I think small menu... That's why I like browns and stuff. Small menus... I just think you need to have the basics and have customizability. No, see, this is the problem. You go anywhere in Lethbridge, and they have to sell 4,000 kinds of everything. It's got to be its own kind of restaurant, right? And I'm not saying this is right. I'm just saying this is what Lethbridge is like. I guess. Oh, I thought that thing was going to fucking The kill. Onion did pretty well, I think, and it had fucking... It yes, had two because or three... it's Lethbridge. Lethbridge. No, Onion has a big menu. Not a, that big. A, a it restaurant... Has, it has different options. A, a normal restaurant like, has one page. The... Okay. I'm just saying. I feel like the onion didn't have that. Like, it had a lot of different stuff, which is fine. I don't care if you have, like, you know, like, different stuff. Like, pull, like uh, pulled pork, chicken nuggets, beef dip. But when it's when you have 6,000 different types of burgers, it's like, really? Eh, I'm okay. How, how much can you customize a burger? A lot. I guess. It's a sandwich. But... Sandwiches are really easy to customize, yo. As someone who's a picky eater, I just don't get it. <laughs> Somebody that likes one thing. It's weird to me. I like a lot of people things. Like I just things. don't like... Well, and a lot of yeah. is very like, diverse, so you have to just change up I for guess. it. I guess. But why not just have customizability? That's true. But people are stupid. I know. Yeah, well, people want hot items. They want, like, to see... 
Which I also don't get. And be like, wow, that seems interesting. I'll try people, it. People, like, I don't know. Maybe it's just because I'm a picky eater. It but is. But there's... <laughs> people, like, praise certain types of food so much. And I'm like, this just tastes like a burger. This tastes like Borg. Is it because I took I've off had, all the toppings? I've, I've had one burger <laughs> that tasted different from every other burger that I've ever had. And it was a peanut butter burger. Uh, you're yes. saying you're saying a regular hamburger tastes exactly like a mushroom swish burger? No. What you I'm pull? saying is they always yeah, praise the food. meat and the, how you cook the meat and all that shit. That's because your tongue is not evolved. I guess. No, like actually, that's a. It's not. That's not right. Not tongue evolved, but like you've never tried things differently. Like try I've try different steaks and shit. They're all the same. It's just no. steak. <laughs> that's the problem. It's not true. So, it is true. Y- Dylan's worked in a kitchen, like an actual kitchen. And yes, I, I have too. Okay. Did True. they... Did, 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 uh, you worked at The Onion. I guess there are chefs there. What? But Dylan worked with like professional chefs that teach yes, people in school. Yes, I worked with a professional chef. Who'd you work with? A professional... I don't know. What do you mean? Who do I work You don't know all the professional chefs. No, no. But I'm saying Dylan worked with people that actually teach people how to cook. Like he worked with people that teach at LCC. What? I went to cooking school. They oh, teach... Don't. I thought you said you worked at the, whatchamacallit? L.A. Chefs. Yeah, L.A. Chefs. Like, three of those people work at LCC as teachers. I don't think that's true. No, it is. Um, Chef Allen was one of the ones. He said he works there. And I, I can't remember. Allen. What? He's so funny. See? You fucking... <laughs> Either way, I worked okay. with a guy who... Chef Allen is funny, though. Who went to that class. And Chef Allen is a teaches you to eat everything kind of guy yeah he's always the one who does the weird stuff yeah like chef allen had us all come in because he had rare steaks he's like okay we need you to try all these steaks i got five different steaks and he made us teach each and every single one chef allen's also the reason i like blue rare steak Mm. oh we gave dan dan the fucking puzzle level he always called me fat and i'm stupid he was also fat he's is he fat i thought he was more chubby well he could have got fatter since i met him i mean he's fatter than me but shorter, so he's like a, you know. I just thought he looked like a Chef Tim Allen. What the fuck? Oh. An Asian Chef Tim Allen? <laughs> you mean Chef Hing? No. Okay, do we know two different Chef Allens and I one's think, Asian? I think so, because the Allen I know is Asian. Okay, well, that's not the one I know. Wow, okay. this was super fucking easy. Yeah, it is, if you know the puzzle. What's Dalen's? Dalen's. Either way, I worked with a chef, and he made me all these different types of stupid foods. And I ate them all, and they were all shit. Maybe you're just tone deaf. Maybe. Because it's like, there is a difference between meat. <laughs> yeah, the difference between meat, but like, not much. Sometimes not much, sometimes tons. Sometimes it's not just flavor, though. Sometimes it's tenderness. Sometimes okay. it's how you cook it. Like, I certain just steaks. Don't get it. Certain steaks should not be cooked well done. When somebody cooks. that's well, Actually, I think no steaks should be cooked well done, but. Unless you're cooking a stir fry. I mean, I have recently discovered. Even in like, stir fry. Medium rare steaks. And I have Aww. to agree. They taste way better than well done steaks. Well done, however, well, well done's not good. <laughs> I've never had a medium like a steak. Like they, I don't know. I've been to. I've, I've, ordered, honestly, I've had steak at so many different restaurants, and it's always the same it, fucking steak. Is it all in Leftbridge? Uh no. Okay, so well, like a lot Lef- of the times they do use the yeah, same steak. Because I was like, especially in Leftbridge, Leftbridge. I know, has, but everyone praises their steak. Like, like uh, I don't know. I don't like. Well, a steaks classic in one is ribeye. Because that's the most flavorful cut. Yeah, I don't know. Everyone wow. always seems so surprised when I say, I, I wish I could never eat again. I've never been surprised about oh, you. Oh, absolutely. Out. No, I feel exactly the same way. Oh, I no, I love that. food. I, I like eating. I like tasting food. But if I could never fucking eat again, that would be a dream. I'd rather not sleep. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Sleep wastes so much more time than eating. It's not the wasting absolutely. time. It's just no, I don't want to do it. Absolutely, it's wasting time for me. For like, sleep, it is. Like we I hate sleeping because got... I feel like I waste time. For eating, to me, it's just a chore. I really? I love eating. Eating makes yeah, me happy. Sometimes it's... there's times where I want to die, but then I eat. Okay, I guess, like... There are eating... times where eating is like a treat, where you have something extremely True. delicious. Yeah. Like when my mom cooks a, like a, a really good meal. From glass yeah. blow? That's good shit. But most of the time, it's just like, oh, I guess I gotta fucking eat. I'm hungry again. Yeah. Uh, well, it's only a chore to me because I'm poor right now. Also nutrition. I would choose, well, I would choose uh, sleep over over not eating because uh, of the waste of time. I wouldn't say I'm poor right now. I spend all my mo- money on booze instead of food because I love drinking. Yeah, I do. Lo- I love drinking too. We, okay, so I don't really. Well, I, I like 
drinking in general, just not really alcohol. Well, yeah, no, okay, that that's different, but I agree with that too. I also like drinking, just liquids. drinking liquids more than I like eating. Absolutely. If I could survive. Although there's certain foods, like oh my god, certain food is so good. Okay, let's all okay, D Dane. Which one do you say first? To the middle. middle. No, no, middle. Okay, now Dylan. Left. Right. See, teamwork. Teamwork made the dream work. Yeah! <laughs> you didn't know. Smack the mushroom. What else did I know that I uh, could hit the mushroom with my fucking stupid ass cape? But yeah, eating is just is so expensive. I love eating. Mainly, cause I uh, I thought I would save money by living in Welling, but I find I'm wasting the same amount of money on just food. Yeah, well, I've been wasting a lot of food money lately because I haven't been making... Because cooking food is the best way to save money. Yeah, but I'm but, never in a kitchen. I yeah, well, that's kind of the same problem because Kurt's mom and sister live here now and they're always sleeping at nighttime. And that's when I'm most productive. And I don't... If I'm... I won't make food if I'm not feeling productive. Which is why I want to just go to Walmart and buy cups of noodles and shit. Because uh, I can cook those down here. You go too... You try to do what I do, but you're too fast. Just gotta go fast, you know? 41 racers, one winner. Me. <laughs> you know what they should make? Okay, me and Dane were talking about Battle Royales. Yeah, so I was thinking, they should make like a survival game Battle Royale that takes a, like an hour or two. World War Z. What? So, what? no, not like a zombie survival. Just no, a, that's, that's just that a is basic a game, survival. That's like a, a game. Like a Hunger Games like game. Where it's not, it's not just about killing the enemies, it's also about making sure you survive. Yeah, but not getting killed by the enemies. Right? So, you mean like Ark? Yes, but... But a battle royale. Obviously a little bit more fast-paced. Would less, it still have like less, the... Uh, what? Storm? The Storm? Yeah, yeah. yeah. So True, that, that, but that's slower. What, that's what we were talking about, is because I think the, they tried to make... Uh, what's the fucking mage one we were playing? Spellbreak. Spellbreak. I think they tried to make that too fast-paced, because the Storm was... It's in the middle in like, what, like five minutes? Yeah. Pretty much. Well, that's the thing, though, because slow games create toxicity. Wow. That's just, that's how life is. That's why League made games you go faster. the wall. I can't, you need to be uh, not small Mario. Do you? Yeah. Oh. That's actually a fact. The It's been, like, proven scientifically that the longer a game takes, the more people get frustrated. Cause it's like, why haven't I won yet? Yeah, fair. Like, think about Dustin. Whenever he's in a really long game, he gets angry and angry. He loves his really long games, though. He loves them when he wins. But yeah. he loves any game where he wins. True. Yeah. But Dustin don't gets... don't have a global chat. Easy peasy. True. Don't no, have any Dustin chat. gets mad at his own friends. Yeah, that's true, too. Like, especially him and Dave. Or him and Bob. Or him and Cranley. Or him and Adam. Or him and anybody else. <laughs> but... I, don't, I just don't really understand toxicity. Like, I'll be fucking annoying in mm. chat when other people are being dicks. But... I don't get when you would kill your fucking teammates because they followed you in a drone. Yeah. We, we were playing a game of Siege the other day, and these this this guy called uh, Fun With Meth, he started the game by like just saying this right like a bunch of racial slurs. Yeah, that's 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 a good start. Yeah, yeah. So, I muted him, and then on like the third round, I followed apparently one of his his friends. In my drone, just to, for fun, because I don't really use my drones that much, actually. Yeah, you and he's good. like, they're, yeah, they're good. Obviously, but, they're good. Otherwise, they wouldn't exist. <laughs> but uh, I don't know. <coughs> when we're playing quick matches, I just don't take it as seriously as I would a ranked match. Yeah. Um, so I follow him in the drone. And he's like, "Don't fucking follow me, guy." Oh, my phone's over there. And then uh, the beginning of that game, he just kills me. And then the beginning of the next game, his friend kills me. And the beginning of the next game, his other friend kills me. And I'm like, cool. So I just have no will to play this game because they're just being dicks and I don't want them to win. Yeah. So I, I follow them every map because they can't kill me after they kill me once. Because yeah. there's a uh, reverse friendly fire on. Yeah. So he gets pissed off. And then the last in the last game, I just get my drone to the top of the, the building and just look out of the sunset. <laughs> and he uh, he's like... 12 you're, the, you're, the, you're what's wrong with the world. You're, you're what makes people kill themselves. <laughs> and I was like, okay. So I just fucking grenaded myself and him. And he's like, <laughs> you're a fucking piece of shit. You're so fucking toxic. 
I was like, bro, Dude, you're you, the one who's just I'm like, told you him literally to quit. killed. You, you literally you killed him. me three rounds in a row, and then told me I'm the reason people kill themselves. Yeah, like that's something. I that just is, don't understand. people. Oh, pull down when you press it. Yeah, that works too. Yeah. Um, I was like, literally, that's like the thing he said to you is the kind of thing that gets people to kill themselves. Yeah. Oh, it was in the right spot at the beginning. <laughs> but now I got all these coins. Oh, when I now you're back at the bottom. <laughs> I started from the bottom. Now I'm here. Started from the top, now I'm here. Now I'm beer. You're dead. Oh, never mind, I didn't see that. Um, yeah, I get kind of mad at people. Actually, I think the thing that gets me mad is tanks. Like, in, for Final Fantasy XIV, which, I, like, I, I get really mad You get at mad at lack of skill of things you know. I get lack, True, I get mad at lack of, or, no, because I didn't get mad at you for Ruby Weapon, and I knew how to do Ruby Weapon. I guess. I get mad at when people can't do simple things. Like, tanks constantly using fucking provoke as a rotation, even when they don't have their tank buff on. Yeah. Like, stuff like that. It's like, yes, I get you're trying to learn the game, but learn the base, just read the move. Read what the move does. <laughs> learn how tanking works in general. Like, it's not my job to teach you at Hades how to fucking tank. If this was like the Pirate's Cove or whatever the fuck it's called, sure, I'll teach you a thing. Yeah, that was Pirate's Cove funner though. <laughs> I also don't take the base game, like, just quick play really serious. Cause no, it, I don't, and oh it, my God. neither should you. Yeah, because, that was, like, treasure. Because I play with the Dylan and Kurt and Mike. Tanner's actually doing really good, even though he's yeah. in the game. But they all don't do that well, I'm not going to lie. Yeah. Some, I mean, obviously there's games where they all, they do well, but... Ta- speaking they almost of, never do as well as me, so get, I just, I, I'm not going to get mad at them, because I... So I just don't care. As I much. don't tend to get mad at my friends in the first yeah. place, except for Dave. But Dave's Dave's a whole other, uh, a whole other creature. I feature. honestly don't get that mad unless other people get mad at me. Yes, and that's why I get mad at Dave. Dave will get mad at not like. There's one time Dave got mad at me because I was like, "Well, Dylan does a lot of damage because he's a samurai," and then Dave's like, "Well, I want to be a samurai, but you told me they were shit." And I was like, "I've never said samurai was shit." <laughs> also, people tend to confuse my. Like gamer, like game frustration with anger, when it's not the same thing. Yes, I agree. I can be that. super frustrated at a game and not be angry, but everyone always says I'm an angry person because I get. It frustrated. comes off that way. Certainly. I don't. I don't yeah. think Dane. I've never played a game with Dane and him being ang- thought he was angry at me ever. I've always thought he was frustrated, but never I get, angry. I guess it's like technically a type of anger, but I'm never angry at someone. Frustration is I'm, anger, but it's more frustration, angry at yourself or the game. I would say frustration's not anger. Well, even if it's just like even if it's with well, the game, but you like, don't even do you ever yell out "fuck you, Mike"? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> but not out of anger. I just say that because it's funny. Oh shit! But like I don't know. I guess I can come off as angry at other people, but I'm never actually angry at my friends well yeah it's just a fucking game where dustin and uh dave they've had well, like literal <laughs> for example the other day actually it was either i think it was yesterday uh dave comes into work and he's like so i got mad at dustin the other day or uh earlier and i'm like oh no what happened and he's like well we're playing tarkov and the whole time i'm yelling that uh, there's a, a guy in this house, and uh, he fucking, I, I come out, and then he shoots me, and I'm like, why did he shoot you? He's like, well, I don't know, I was telling him, and you think, blah, 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 and I'm like, uh, doesn't it, like, show you who your teammates are? He's like, no. I'm like, well, that's probably it. Oh, fuck. That part's actually really hard. Me and Colton, we were really drunk on sake one night doing this dungeon. <clears throat> it took us... I don't think we beat it. I think we we're way too drunk. We drank a lot of sake. Yeah. But uh, I think that's a big situation where it's like... It's an honest mistake. Even if you think that they should be doing better, a mistake's a mistake. And you can't really get mad at your friends. Yeah. Your own brother. Like, eh. actually angry? If, it, if I'm going to get mad at anyone, it probably would be my brother. <laughs> I, I guess. I don't know. I just... But I don't, think I, I don't think I've ever gone mad at you. Oh, my God. I tried to do my... There it is. I can't remember how to do my spinny jump. <gasps> I don't think I've ever gone mad at you playing Final Fantasy, have I? Maybe against no. about lore stuff, but that's because I get pretty passionate about the lore stuff sometimes. 
Well, that's that's different. That's too. entirely, and that's different. not me getting mad at that's you. It's, that's an argument. Us being dickheads and getting heated in an argument about. Yeah, stuff I don't think I don't think fucking matter. I think that's more. Well, I think also, I think story is important. I think every sure, person I know gets important. mad about story. I get more angry. And still, I'm, it's an argument. Not it's mad. less about the story and more. You know you're right, or I think I know I'm right, mm-hmm. and so. I like Each that you. Us. I like that yours wasn't that I'm wrong. You're like I'm probably wrong, <laughs> even though I'm pretty sure you were right about that M itself Selk thing. Now, I've done a lot more research, and it actually makes more sense for it to be M itself. Yeah. But I don't think M itself did anything. I think he just showed up to be a dickhead. Yeah. Cause um, the crystal clearly did everything. That Azim's crystal. Right. It clearly did everything to get you out of there. He just showed up to be like, yeah, I made a crystal. Fuckhead. Fucking stupid. Fucking skeleton. Dumbass. Rock. Bullshit. This Honestly, level's... I get more angry when I'm playing a game and I get frustrated with it, and then people say, "Why are you so angry? You don't have to be angry." Yo, yeah, yeah. I'm like, I'm not fucking when... angry at you. I'm that's, just frustrated. That's, that's normal human behavior. If anybody calls you out on being something you're not, you're gonna get mad about it. Yeah, and, uh, yeah. Kobe's the worst for that. Man, yeah, I, he does it because he he knows it'll make me angry. I I think Kurt gets angrier than most of us. I think the only person that gets angrier than Kurt is Dustin. I've just never understood when people get angry and then also get angry at their friends for it. I like, think it's weird when <laughs> Zeno shows up again and Linda just doesn't even try to fight. He's like, fuck it, I'm out of here. Oh, fuck. Yeah, you have to beat him there. Oh. <laughs> you have to beat him like you beat your dead yeah. wife. Give me that. I can get just these powers back. Thank you. He always gets thing. for us and then we lose. <laughs> I lose him too, to be fair. Uh, did you guys see any of the cool Mario stuff coming? No. That's cool, no, Mario. You told me about it. There's a Mario Party Mario 3D5. It's a Mario One Battle Royale. What does that even mean? <laughs> so you play, you know, the first Mario game. Can I go in these. Sure. You play that, and there's 35 other people playing. Ah, oh, it's like Tetris 99. Yeah, but Mario. That's fucking. They're only no, for it's a limited super. Co- time. Yeah, it's th- that's what's dumb is it's only for a limited time. That their marketing plan doesn't make sense to me. Especially, them. well, okay, it makes sense if it does shit. <laughs> but if it does guess, really well, how hard is it to keep that server maintained? Not, not at all. I don't. I, that's that's what's weird to me. Well, no, but if no one plays it, who cares? You can just run through them. You're invincible. Oh yeah. <laughs> you're dead now, though. <sighs> what? Also, Dayton play a second you level. Wasted your time. Did I? Yeah, oh, you're yeah, supposed yeah. to. Just oh, run. oops. <laughs> I forgot. Yeah, I'm sorry. What the fuck is this? Why don't I get your cool? I think we got game <laughs> over. <laughs> Should we try? No, we should fucking end this. Yeah, podcast. I think it's a, this is a perfect time to end. We beat World Two. Mario's an angel now. Morton's cast. Anyone want? Anybody have anything they want to want to pitch? Uh, I should be on this more often. Just dig. That's not a pitch. That's a suggestion. <laughs> hey guys, I should be on this more often. Uh, I'm a great guy. I, uh, I'm funny. Lo- I talk well. <laughs> talking louder doesn't make it a pitch. I was just <laughs> pitching myself. No, pitching is like, hey guys, I'm Dane. I have a book coming out in next week. It's about how my my oh, wife. Oh, uh, check out my stream at twitch.tv slash Captain Dilbin. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one. Thanks. I like your stream. What's your stream? Uh, twitch.tv slash. Say Captain Dilbin. Bald tailed. <laughs> he doesn't. He doesn't stream anymore. Yeah. I give away all my shit to Dane. Wait, Dan, you gave all your shit to him? No. Did you not hear him? He gave his shit to me. His computer, his monitor. I'm trying to play your belly button. What? What are you listening? Anyways, thanks everybody for coming out. Next week, uh, we will bring back to a normal kind of video schedule, hopefully. Uh, Zelda's almost over. No, Zelda should be done by the next podcast we have one. Uh, and what else is going on? Spookfest. Coming do I, soon. Do I get to be in Spookfest? Uh, probably not. You can come do uh, Spookfest streams with me, but not Spookfest recording. So we should, uh... I'll tell you after. What? Say it. We should record early on Wednesday. Why Wednesdays? This like Wednesday? Tomorrow? Yeah. Or two days from now? Two days from now. Today is Monday. Remember, uh, we're recording. No, we said we weren't going to because you, you always give up on it. You give up on the dream. You're like, I give up on this dream. <laughs> you said we're fucking recording a bunch of shit on Oh, what are we doing for Thursday? Barbecue. I don't fucking know. Yeah, I'll slip barbecue. No, no, I mean for um for the stream. For the stream that's already out by this point. I don't know, Siege. 
I'm not going to play Siege. <laughs> I already tried to get him to play Siege a long time ago. He never would with me. Why? It's not the kind of game I... Why would you think I'd ever like that game? Well, it's not that you like I, Why it's would I ever game? like that I game? Play. I uh, you like shooters. No, I don't. You like teamwork. You literally not play Doom while watching him play Doom. Well, okay, yes. Doom is not a cover shooter. So? I play Doom. So? Doom is a different kind of game. Don't yeah, but what does it matter if he's playing? Oh, I, no, I mean a stream to do together. Oh. A game to play together, not a... Well, you can't play Siege together. Oh, I guess you could. Yeah, why can't we? have to be listen. online. Yeah, that's what I was saying. I don't even well, own that game. you have to be online to stream. Yeah, I know, but... You got to apologize. All right, goodbye, everybody. Goodbye. Uh, he's digging into my leg. Yeah, Dave doesn't care about that kind of shit. He just masturbates. True. In my blanket, apparently. What? my blanket, apparently, according to... What do you...